huge congratulations on managing to take down phase once again here obviously are stopping their intel grand slam run here in malta as well i first of all want to start off by talking about your own performance you were absolutely on fire throughout the entirety of the series today what were you focusing on in terms of your own performance coming into this one uh we're just practicing a lot uh, especially for teams like uh face uh, very skill uh, skilled teams and uh, i work in a lot I'm trying uh, to work more and more and more uh, every day. Uh, I have uh, supporting people behind me and they helping me really much and yeah. The hard work definitely paying off. Really looking forward to seeing what else you're going to be delivering throughout this tournament. Um, just speaking more specifically about this series at hand, um, you guys started off on the T side throughout all three maps in this series, choosing to start on the T side for Inferno. Why was that? Why did you uh, choose to start on that side? Mm, I don't know I can say about it because I don't know, just uh, our coach uh, decided uh, which side we can play and maybe it's com more comfortable though for us, maybe, I don't know. <laughs> okay, fair enough. Um, Ancient pick as well, that kind of took us quite off guard because we hadn't seen you guys playing it uh, since back in Cologne. Can you tell me, uh, Hobbit had said before in an interview that you guys have been practicing a little bit more. What translated from that practice coming into this official today? Uh, about Ancient or? Yes. Ah, uh, yeah. Ancient, yes, uh, we are working um, uh, at this map a lot and uh, we are confident in this map because, uh, I don't know, he like our style, uh, he just, yeah, he, it's a good, uh, good map for our style, yeah, I can say like that. He also mentioned that you spotted a few weaknesses from FaZe. Can you kind of give us a hint as to what they were? Did they come up in the game today on Ancient? Because obviously you managed to win that map. Can you repeat, please? Uh, just FaZe's weaknesses. Hobbit was saying that you kind of spotted a couple from looking at some of their demos on that map. What exactly were those weaknesses from FaZe? Weaknesses. <laughs> it's hard. I don't remember this word and its main weaknesses, weaknesses. It's okay, you can you can keep the cards close to your chest, that's all right. I want to talk about your next matchup as well, because obviously you're going to be a bit of a battle of uh, North American organizations, uh, Cloud9 going up against Liquid. What are you thinking of Liquid's form at the moment? Uh, liquid form is very good. Uh, Yekendar uh, making um, big uh, and good job for Liquid. Uh, he really good player, and uh, we will see we'll, which team will win tomorrow or I don't know when. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it will be a good uh, match because uh, NA organizations. It's really important for Cloud9 or, or yeah and yeah. We're really looking forward to seeing how that one does play out. Thank you so much for your time, Axel. Huge congratulations once again. Thank you so much.